Hello everybody, I am Brandman19 and welcome to episode 14 of our Prussia campaign in Empire Total War. Last time we fought a gigantic war here to uh, eliminate uh, the troops surrounding Vienna and we killed quite a few. I'm going to go ahead and just jump on into this one. Um, they have 600 Firelock armed militia versus 1,794 of mine. Might as well just go ahead and jump in. Uh, it's not too difficult of a battle, I'm sure, because all we gotta do is just climb up the walls, and I think we would win against every single group there. So, uh, I think we out, well, we outnumber them almost three to one. Now, not all of my rifles, uh, line infantry are perfect, but they're ready to go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Actually... These guys are going to assault from the front. The rest will assault from the right side. There we go. There are some hurt regiments out there. That's to be expected to kind of line up a little funky. Um, let's go ahead and grab all of it. And in the deployment, and let's go forward. Let's see if they can, uh, if they'll have to shift their focus towards us or not. I mean, they're going to have to shift their focus some. Right here we go, right there. Should bring us very close. Oh wow, they have men outside still. So these three are going to go over here. there. Uh, these two are going to go right there. Get that out of the way. There we go. So those two go there. These four are going to go right here. It's these two going in the middle, and then these four will come out here. These guys are going here. These guys are going there. Everybody's going to be toggled up for melee. Toggled up for melee. There we go. Now we just gotta march into position. Go on. Go ahead and fling it up there. There it goes. Nice, okay. Other side. Run. I'm going to have this guy move over here. Because he's got another job. He's going to take that side over there. This guy's going there. Going there. Going there. Run. Going there. Going there. There. Run. Go in there. Go in there. Go in there. Run. Go in there. Run. Going right here. Run. Okay. Everybody's assaulting where they should be assaulting or getting close to it. Get 
And this guy's gonna come all the way over here, and he's just gonna climb up this side and be right on top where he needs to be. Matter of fact, he can actually run all the way there, because he's not gonna attack anybody when he's there. And up this we shall go. Swarm. Let's actually swarm them like this. Everybody up the wall, up the wall, up the wall. This guy's already got 58. This one right here is at 60, and they completely kind of bypassed him right now. Okay. Yep, we've already taken over this. Apparently. <laughs> go, we've taken over this one. Take over one more, and I think we get all of them. Trying to get more people upon. Yep, gonna bring these guys down here. They run up there. Matter of fact, um, I want you to both kind of sit right there. All right, rush into this side. Let's go ahead and help them. Clear out my sides here. He's down to two. These guys are down to eleven, down to nine. He's down to twenty-four here. Let's go ahead with him here. Go ahead and help over here. Yep, they're about to climb up on that side. Come on, men. This guy's down to 21. We use these guys down here. I think we have now taken over three of the four uh, gates. All right, these guys are pretty much done. These guys are down to two. Shattered, shattered. I think they're all shattered now. Yep. We killed all of them but three, so that's seven of them. Oh, there goes their general. In the battle, there we go. Vienna is now ours. It only took us eight, like, less than eight minutes to have that battle. Okay. 133 people lost. All right. What can I do to fix this place up? Um, well, getting rid of the seminary is a good start for us. Getting rid of that classical university is a good idea. Okay, next turn we're going to make about 5,000 according to the game, so we'll see how that goes. In the turn, let's see how this works. Great Britain is just protecting our trade. There's the Austrians. They're just more of a nuisance right now than anything else. Oh, okay. So Poland is going to declare war on us now. So we're only at war with... Now we're at war with Austria and Poland again. So, obviously they did not like that we were never taking that military alliance. We gotta shift that army back from Coraline back west. 
Or we can come south on them somewhere. I, gotta, I can figure that out. Um, military alliance with Sweden. We're indifferent towards each other. I don't really want a military alliance with you just right now. Not right now. If you would have asked me right before Poland came through, though, I probably would have said yes. It's the pirates? Okay. The ruling classes have written a letter of demands to your national leader. Got a as gentleman they are here. With the current government. Failure to comply will lead to an organized rebellion against you. Acquiescence at this stage could lead to further demands. Where exactly will you draw the line? Okay, people in Austria are on, uh, running on strike right now. Uh, let's fix this. Yeah, I do have policies set. Um, let's go ahead and build a church school. Let's send these men over here. Infiltrate that. Alright, he got in. One, two, fix those. There you go. Top row got fixed. Five, let's fix those five. Those are the two hardest ones hit, and then those... Th okay, there we go. Alright, um... We're holding here. If I pull out of that... I could make a launch for Vilnius here. They have ex next to nothing here, so that's not a bad idea. 825 versus 480. Let's continue our siege on it. How long is that siege going to last? Four turns? Uh, that's not a good siege then. The church school. Um, what do they have here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Versus. Yeah, I don't know if that's going to be worth it right now. Oh, if he sends that army that way, though, we're in trouble. I don't think Russia actually joined the war, though. Yeah, they're having to hold on for dear life here right now. Um, they, don't, they have a pretty good army there, though. Um, let's wait this out. I have no other choice but to wait it out. I have next to no money and stuff like that. We just need to wait it out, try to rebuild our forces, prepare for the rebels that are inevitably, inevitably going to strike up. We already going to know we're going to lose this. Um, we're still going to fight it. It's 240 men that can sit on the wall and shoot directly down on them. So I think it's worth trying. Okay. Ooh. Let's put them in here. Put them in here. Let's do it. Come on. Come right at me, guys. They come directly at me, they have really no. I mean, we'll funnel them in here and their numbers won't mean anything. We'll take good shots. Hopefully, they just. They don't go over the wall somewhere else, though. 
I guess the computer is probably smart enough to do that. Yep, try to force your way in here. We'll start taking shots at you. Yeah, we're trying to shoot them all up again. They're just trying to hold the gap. Yep, there he goes, wavering. Did take him down to 82. Have him down at 22. Come on. Fight back, men. We're doing the absolute best we can, and I know it. My general could possibly die, and then this whole thing will be for nothing. Yep, he's shattered. Not a bad little try, though. We did really well. <laughs> Close defeat. But, I mean, I know we had to kill a good amount. Yeah, we killed 153. Or killed 139. They say we they lost 153. That's not bad. Considering what we were up against. What are these guys? I... I don't even know what these guys are, but I'm going to do it. I have no other choice, honestly. Okay. This looks uh, almost satisfactory to me. Just let it happen, let's go. Charge at me. <laughs> oh, they killed one guy, two guys with that, okay. Come on, bring your men. Killed five, killed seven. Why are they uh, going up there first? Position. Not too worried about this because here we go. I don't know if they've got a fire by rank or not, but they don't, I don't think. Take your shots. Hold the edge here. He's down to 89. Fire it on that side. Let's fire on this side, guys. Yep, he's already broken and running. He's at 64, he's at 89. Looks like they're going to try to run it towards us. Okay. He's shattered. Fire. 
He's down to 77. He's at 97. He's now broken. Let's keep firing. Yep, he's shattered now. Look how big that square is. It's huge. Bring out together. He's now broken at 53. He's now shattered himself again. Oh, well, fired him. Let's hit the little guy. There we go. 46. Yep, shattered himself there. He's at 98. He's brung his artillery forward. some reason. I guess because he feels like it's going to give him a better shot here. Alright, come on, give him another shot. He's broken. Go ahead and run up. and lay into this guy. Now he's wavering already. Come on, give him another shot. One more. There you go, shattered. Okay, to the top of the hill we go. I think a line right here in front of us. There we go. And almost fire. Yep, he's wavering, he's at 40. Broken and shattered there. Let's go forward. Trying to get in position of these guns. He's wavering now, he's broken. He hasn't even been surely shot at yet. Give him a shot. Okay. go keep on hitting them that guy's at 12 and he's shaking we need a little bit more This guy's shaking now. Move up a little bit. Alright, this guy right here is going to take a pretty good shot at him, I believe. Well, if you can see him. Three shattered, shattered. Let's go ahead and take the whole field, and it looks like they're gonna run off. Okay, I have no clue why this little army was where he was, but uh, because even I mean he was close to them. 
He was, I mean, he's on the east side of Warsaw. Good lord, come on. Um, it's alright. Let him take it. He had a pretty big move there, but he's got a lot of hurt armies now. Come on, Swedes, get the... Oh, looks like they're at war with Poland, too. Okay. Oh, I can sign some new trade deals down here, can't I? Rioting has broken out in this region as the lower orders have become too unhappy. The gentleman here. You must either appease the rioters by lowering taxes or send in the troops to put them down. Send him to Munster. You do, act quickly before the riot becomes a rebellion. Okay, um, workers on strike, layers of demand, workers riot. It's all going on over here. You know, in a region I have zero control over. Is this hurting us? No. Fix that. There we go. At least we can fix this up. Looks like the Poles are going to try to run the table now. Um, let's see, we're at 1348. How's Prestige looking? So that's not where Prestige is. Here we go. Polish are at 173. So they're just below us in Prestige. Austria is way back. The Mughals are still there. The Swedes are ahead of us in prestige. That's really weird. Um, okay, so here's what we'll do. We'll take this first. Take Vilnius. Hold the area around it. Um, oh, I know what happened. That guy got sent from over here. That does present something very funny. I can go for Warsaw now. Like... I could legit go for Warsaw. I don't know if I'd hold it, but let's go for it now. I mean, why not? I mean... I could either go for it and... or think about going for it and never hit it. I mean, this is... I have very few forces in some cases, but... Go forward, go. Let's get them here. Let's take these two are going to go. He's going on that side. He's going on that side. These three are going to go right here. These two are going right here. Let's set them all up for success. We started with only 36 more than them, but we do have a lot of men lost. Okay, you ready? These guys are getting up. You go there. You go there. Both of you run. You're going here. You're going there. You're going here. You're all going to run. That one. There we go. I want to send these both across the across the way. He's down to 56. He's at 16. He's at 20. He's at 38. I made them have to spread out a little bit more than they probably wanted to. Come on, men. Come 
Hector's at 5, he's at 29. Uh, you should probably be helping these guys out, shouldn't you? This guy's down to 21, he's at 60, he should be at 50, yeah, he's at 60 almost. This guy's at 8. down to six. We'll end up using these guys to crush into these guys on that flank. Send these men down here. He's down to one. Let's come running off over here. Keep moving. Destroy that little group. This guy's gonna run over here. I'm gonna hopefully try to grab the point. This guy's down to one. <laughs> this is so funny. Just running. Just. We're about to flood out of here and make our numbers really be known. Come on, men. Fight it out. Fight it out right there, yeah. There you go. There's only one guy left here. This guy's down to 29. He's attacked from multiple directions. This guy has 60, this one has 72, and we're preparing to march forward. I wonder who's their general. Maybe this guy. Good lord, they, may, they took like, what, two or three of our regions, but we're going to come back and take Warsaw? Like, I mean, I wonder if that just equals out to each other or not. Especially considering my regions are more likely to, you know, fight him back. His will definitely, but like I might be able to hold him down. He's down to two. He's down to four. This other one's down to four as well, I think. Are you ready? Take your shots. Down by six. They're down by 19. They're now broken. That's the end of them. And they shattered at 41 as well. There it goes. End the battle. Heroic victory. How many did we lose? 133. They lost all 600. And that makes Warsaw ours. Exempt the region from tax. All right. There's Luau now. Let's see, can I go ahead and try to get a new with Venice? Yeah, you can have military access to me. That's fine. They pay me a thousand to do this too, so not going to turn down that money. Um. Cost me sixteen fifteen for everybody. I can fix this place up for a little bit less. Um, can't get rid of the classical university because they're sitting on top of it, so that's going to be a problem. Yeah, my lord. He doesn't have a general. They don't have a general. Best Is there a general here? I don't know. Let me get the agents out though. You have a general? No. You have a general? No, these are like some leaderless armies, man. Oh. 
Okay. I think the next time I'll go ahead and take this and we'll just kind of deal with the fallout of having so many places that we have to hold on to. But as you can see, they're having some problems back here having to hold those areas. So, we'll hope for the best. Hopefully they'll lose this one too. I don't want them to take Austria out completely. That's for me. So, alright guys, appreciate you all so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. I'll see you guys next time.